eating Safety one. I am uh, I, uh, I am the Anime News Network, and uh, how about you join this lovely cult in Japan? That uh, I don't know what it does, but it's a cult. Have you found any context of it as of right now? No, I didn't have time. You can do that. So, uh, yeah. are you guys excited yeah. for uh, 2018 season two? It's great. Alright. So anyway, welcome back to the Octopath Traveler live stream session 18. Holy shit! This uh, live stream session can now drink in the, our country. Just give it some time. It's gonna be. It can. It will be able to drink. In every country beside the Middle East. Can you drink in North Korea? I don't think you can. Besides the leader, of course. The dear leader can't drink. Everyone else knows. Mm -hmm. no. Fuck him. So... Is something mm -hmm. troubling you, Primrose? I can't wrap my head around it. Having faith so strong that you'd give up your own life for it. See, I prefer to put my faith in myself. When I feel helpless or find myself in trouble. I click I click the click on the te on the um, keyboard as you are hearing right now, and, le and then I saw that a uh, anime cultist like the anime news network uh, supported a cultist group apparently. That sounds really fucked up, but dude, fine words. Sorry, sorry, no, I don't think there's any other news about it. Like the only news I get is from anime's anime news network from an article in 2015. <laughs> Okay, well, it's probably really new then. Yeah. I think they removed the ad too, so we'll hear, we'll hear about it some one day. Well, no, probably not so long after. Probably next week, we'll have all the news possible. But you'll still let me help you, won't you? At least some of the time. Because, come, that, come what may, I am your friend and ally. I've never had friends and allies. Oh, I had that one girl, but she's dead. Uh, she's dead. Please stop crying. I am your Nakama, and nothing will change that, you idiot. Oh, nice. We still have the fucking clips from last session. Not too long, not for long, but still. <laughs> I think the clips actually stay if you search for them. Probably, but that means that I should I need to remember their names as well. <clears throat> Father Where <gasps> My sex toy I mean Lisa, oh my precious girl! I think I'm hearing something really illegal right about now. See, Lisa, I told you that everything will be alright. Thank you from the bottom of my heart, Sister Ophelia. I do not know. It's been two fucking weeks, weeks since we did this shit. I don't remember what's going on at all. We saved That's the child. Right. That's about it. Last time we spent time, you know, trying to survive lingering well. And that's, you know, that's last week. I mean, like this game two weeks ago, we just... It's like, yeah. It's been a long time. Nothing can take the place of family. Sister Ophelia. Now, shall we begin the kindling? Yes, everything is ready now. I will show you the altar. And in this plot twist, it is revealed that um, every time the flame gets kindled in this city, someone needs to be burned for a sacrifice. And the one who was supposed to be sacrificed is his daughter. Who would have seen that one coming, am I right, guys? I was thinking for a moment that it would say something about like kindling your daughter. I think I just said that. <laughs> yeah, but kindling, I said like. You're burning your yeah. I don't hear that word. It sounds something dirty more. Regardless, the Anime News Network supports this apparently. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's gonna. That's not gonna die anytime soon. <laughs> no, it isn't. Don't sacrifice your children, dumbasses. I think the flame just spoke to us. We should burn everyone. That's literally what I just didn't say. I literally meant the opposite. Why are you doing exactly what I <laughs> say the opposite? Well, the priest said the opposite, so it must be true. Who is this priest? Oh, he says he can talk to God. 
Oh, does he have proof he can talk to me? Well, no, but he said he can do it, so I believe him. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> but you are a god! She's <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, I believe you. Okay. I'll just listen and believe you. Listen and believe. And this feminist religion is fucking hardcore. <laughs> The flame has been lit by the ember that accompanied you and your journey, sister. I have no doubt that it will shelter us with the same gentle kindness that you have shown us all. Nothing would make me happier, your excellency. Still, Ophelia, I have heard that the flame bears of... oft face great... You mean often face great trials in their journey? Okay. Trials, you say? How can I say it? Those with kind hearts will find themselves shouldering the pain of others as it were their own. I would have it no other way. If I can help lessen another's pain by taking a portion of it upon myself, I am more than happy to do so. You are strong and noble. You are, a, you are a strong and noble woman, sister Ophelia, and your kind heart has brought us succor su su today. Do, do you mean success? I don't know what the fuck you said. After this, you will be returning to Flame's Grace, yes? Pray spent the night in the west before moving on. Thank you, Your Excellency. I happily accept your gracious offer. <laughs> Ophelia. Anna? What, what, uh, whatever are you doing here? Were you not staying at your father's side until he recovered? He's dead! <gasps> Thank you, I'm here. That's why I'm here, Philly. He's fucking dead. I can't believe he's fucking dead. I've taken... How did he fucking die? You're sick! Sick? Sick? Well, we could've got... Hey, we have an apothecary! Then why the fuck did you not go back home, you fucking idiot? Oh. Here, have this. Diana, uh, thanks now. Tell me what has happened. Promise you you'll stay calm, Ophelia. I don't think that's possible. Father is no longer with us. <sighs> then, right, so should I just like, I wanna like I just have a sad song play, you know, at background, like an auditor song. <laughs> <laughs> No! I think you need to find the saddest, the smallest and saddest. Yeah. No, it's called violin to play with. <laughs> the smallest oh. violin in the world. Yes. I play a really sad song with it. Man, that fucking hurt when I was playing, like. <laughs> when I was, you know, destroying the credits in the Autonoma. And it suddenly I needed to destroy the violence in the music. It hurt so much. I can't believe he's fucking dead! <laughs> and if maybe you want to turn out the, the, the stream sound for yourself. I can't believe it. He had so much to live for. <laughs> he had two daughters too. I can't believe he's fucking dead. Now I'm going to be in my room and eat ramen until one of my friends slaps the shit out of me and tells me to <laughs> just, just, just I'll keep doing shit for fuck's sake. Everyone dies when they are killed. Fucking dipshit. But even then, it's just too sad. It's too painful. <laughs> this world is so cruel. I must destroy the world. For it took my father. I have no more family left. Well, that's my, well except for my sister, but she's gonna die in the next episode, I know it. It's like, she's gonna kick me in the dick. Oh, in the pussy, this, uh, this, uh, this uh, instance. He's gonna hit my boobs. He's gonna hit my boobs, the, the, the devil. 
not like that. And the true villain is revealed. It is me from the future. Now, this doesn't make any fucking sense. What the fuck am I reading right now? Who, who wrote the script? Ryan Johnson! Oh no! <laughs> uh, he subverted my expectations. <laughs> he subverted my expectations. God damn. Actually, he didn't. It's exactly what I expected, to be honest. <laughs> like I called everything. Uh. I wonder if that will get us copyright struck. <laughs> so for my expectations. Oh no, no, my expectations were subverted on this board. He fucking... <laughs> he fucking, like, copyrights the word subverting your expectations. <laughs> your Excellency. He's gone, Fiddy. Father is... Father he he. And you told me to stay calm, now you're crying. This is too shit. I can't live in this world anymore. I must now simply destroy. <laughs> what? What? My body? I'm sorry, I actually killed your or father. Nani! I'm going to now subvert your expectations. I am actually the true villain. I am actually a reincarnation of the devil himself. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm sorry, Fiddy, but I need to subvert your expectations. Honestly, at this point, it's my favorite fucking word. <laughs> it came out of this entire fucking shit. Liana. What, Nani? Ugh. I'm sorry, but we now must die. I'm sorry, Fiddy, but I need to need that ember for father. Did you bring the ember? Oh, my sub my expectations were subverted, Ennis! How? How? Oh! It all makes sense now! All finished after necromancy, all those necromancers, guys in black ropes. It oh. does? Yeah, fuck you, and fuck you. <laughs> Amura's a genius, alright? He predicted this. <laughs> he told us the prophecy, uh. and we didn't believe him. And think about it. With the necromancy, they can bring his fa her father back. So now she will give to her them the ember, so they can revive people, but it's all fake. Uh. Nothing but pray. They could offer you only empty words. We can offer you something more. With this ember, we can make your every wish come true. You really mean it? Come with me, back to the whis whisper mill. No, Liana, you can't. Sorry, Philly. In order to bring people back to life, sacrifices have to be made. Equivalent exchange, motherfucker. Oh, she's still Philia, you came back to at, uh, us at last. Where, where am I? Uh. Pray that stay at rest, sister. It appears you were drugged with some manner of sleeping drugs. Oh! I, I, I stand to skip that. Liana, why? Why did you do it, Liana? Sorry, Ophelia. I thought I simply told you. I simply destroy. <laughs> Do not to blame your excellency, the one who took the ember. Sister Ophelia, they mentioned going back to Whisper Mill. You're not thinking of chasing after them, are you? Sorry, but I have to subvert your expectation. <laughs> <laughs> if, it is only a rumor, sister. But word has it that many in Whisper Mill have turned their back on the sacred flame. They follow a man who calls himself the savior. The savior, you say? Is he Jesus? Yes! Yes! I am! This Alpador is actually Jesus this entire time, who would have thought? It's first my expectations, for sure. You know, he died for Polnareff's sins, you know? Twice. 
this group they say is spreading the word that our teachings are that our teachings are not but lies. I mean, are they wrong though? You see, a terrible plague struck the village not all that long ago, and a great many people died. Our fate did not keep their loved ones from dying in their grief. No doubt they began to look elsewhere and friends to their prayers. Hey guys, what about we just help, like start a doctoring more? What? Nani? What's this science shit? Get the fuck out of here. You mean to go there, don't you, Whisper Mill? Yes, I must take back the Amber. The Amber and Liana both. I can see you have made your, up your mind. Will not stand in your way, but pray take care of yourself, sister. These villains have already resorted to kidnapping and death threats. There's no telling what they might do to you. Thank you for your concern, Your Excellency. I must be careful. Why, Lyanna? Why would you do such a thing? Because I simply destroy. Why yeah. does everybody I meet want to destroy the world? Why does everyone we meet wants to destroy? <laughs> so, uh, I think we have stolen from here. Secret flame, Mr. Mill, the flat plants, is that like. Is, uh, yeah, subverting expectations everywhere. Sounds great. That's a good plan. Should we subvert more expectations? Yes. Uh, Absolutely. Right, so, so let's uh, let's see what what more do we have left? We have uh, that's a chapter four. It's a chapter. This is chapter. This is chapter three. There was also a chapter three, but uh, it's chapter forty. Chapter four. Chapter four. Man, I think we're doing pretty well. So let's. Um, I think we're going to snow, still snow actually. All right. Since when we're done with like Ophelia's story, <laughs> it's. I just did it. It has really been like two weeks. As... Yeah, like two weeks ago, yeah, the, like... they kidnapped the child, we saved, it, we saved her. And now this session, we're bringing, we brought her back, and uh, now we got betrayed. <laughs> and our father died, and we're sad now. So... <clears throat> we're doing chapter 3, right? We're doing chapter 3 right now. And we're going to have to bring Honey with us. Oh boy. And Ophelia is not going to be on our party. Let's let's um, who has level 40 chapter 3? So uh, Primrose and Cyrus, I think. I think that's the only that chapter 3 is left. So we have to bring Cyrus with us and uh, Primrose. Or at least I think we have to bring. Yeah, we do have to bring uh, her. Well, let's go to the inn. No, not the inn, the pub first. But it's been, it has been a long ass time. Well, my traveler, what can I do for ye? That's a good question. Uh, Ellis, do you know what he can do for us? Let's see, well, we're going to bring Cyrus with us. Change him for Philia. Not sure about Elfin. What can he do for us? Get us a better scriptwriter for the next Yu-Gi-Oh film. Yu-Gi-Oh film? I mean fucking Star Wars, my fault. <laughs> Man, uh, 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 did you, don't you just hate the fact that Ryan Johnson just ruined Yu-Gi-Oh with this movie? Man. Since when was Yu-Gi someone who dueled with hate? That's stupid. <laughs> I know, right? My least favorite part though was when uh, you say Fuda was fighting riding on a car instead of a motorcycle. Like what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's first by expectation. Get fucked. <laughs> I get people accept that their expectations should be a subverted dance. No, you're stupid for that idea. But the expectations should be subverted, all of them. I sold it here. Honestly, all of my favorite thing is like in all of the fucking interviews, where they, you know, <clears throat> how should I say, where they did, you know, where uh, Mark Hamill was saying like, yes, you know, the problem is. I said to Ryan many times that yeah, you know, we need to think of the fans, we need to think of the, you know, of this product and shit. And he said no, no, we're not. We're gonna think of the movie and the money that we're gonna make. 
And then, you know, everybody fucking applaud when he quoted, quoted that line. And, you know, you see him disappointed, right? Mm. See his sad face. But then right after, you know, the applaud happens and, you know, Ryan is just saying, yeah, you did your best. Now shut the fuck up. Now it's my turn to talk. And this man says right up there, from, yeah, I was never really a Star Wars fan. I <sighs> love that shit, you know? Like, what the fuck are you even trying to accomplish? You're not a fan of the series, and you're not even trying to make a good movie for somebody who actually seems to love his role. Or love, no, he still loves his role as the young Luke Skywalker, not this grumpy old man. It's not, it's not even Luke anymore, it's just grumpy. Yeah, exactly, it's grumpy, and you know, Mark Hamill just loves the young Luke, he loves that character. And the, 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 you can see it on his face, and this is, and they're just destroying the man as well. Uh, Not only the fucking character, but also the man that played the character. Also by just forcing him to not give on his honest opinions. That's also the thing. It's fucking disgusting. Uh, but let me think for a second. I have no idea what I want these characters to be. So what do we have? We have the rest. I have too this many mages. Yeah, you do. And I don't really see, like, Primus as a physical class. It's kind of hard to... Uh... Here's how you should think about it. What abilities do they miss? Let's think about it like that. What ability do they need? Honestly, I don't, I'm kind of good with abilities so far, I would say. Did Cyrus get the MP regen? Did he? The, you know, the regeneration of return? Might. From the dancer. He did. Yeah, he did. Okay. All right. What other things do we have that he would need? I don't know. Like to get? It's been too long. <laughs> what other abilities do we have? Second win wasn't. That... No, no. Wait, there are some good abilities that Hunter has, but then again, those are better for physical fighters, mm -hmm. like second, no, second surfing and. How about, here's a fun fun, uh, here's a funny fun, fun. Uh, how about we make Therese for the time being a hunter so she gets the, uh, what do you call it, the second turn thing, the patience. Hmm, I mean, yeah, but what, ability, some... what ability would I get rid of though? What abilities are useful then, let, let, let's look at that like. What ability is useful right now? Snatch, uh, hang tough. Oh, that's one at second chance. SP safer. Yeah, the thing is that abilities are so good. <laughs> it's like... Yeah, you did get old. But wait, what about we check the other characters' abilities? Maybe they want an SP safer. That yeah, would become merge. Actually, we could. I mean, we should just make him the merge. I would think. Should if yes, be... you know, if, why not give the mage characters the SP safer ability then? I actually think we should make uh, Science the Virgin then, because he can get the save. He can get if he doesn't have it already, yeah, yeah, that's a good one. Uh... <laughs> and then he, with this next skill he got the space sa saver ability. <laughs> no, I need, I, need, I need one more. <laughs> well, that, would be, that would be funny though. <laughs> okay, I don't know what to do anymore. Oh, oh fuck. Well, hmm. well, we yeah. already have a mage and... I think the only thing we could need is an apothecary, but eh. Uh, what about Honey? Would she would she need any other ability as a melee fighter? Not really. She has space and second surfing. Probably something else that she got from other classes. Summon strength. And I think the only thing we really need is a thief. Do we? Oh, you know what we could do? How about what? we make Tressa a thief? And then make Primrose a white mage. Why not? She will now use both light and darkness. <laughs> use both light and darkness? You are a genius. I think this job actually makes sense. And then we make... Uh, make Primrose here the... Uh, Cleric, which means that she needs to learn some new skills, so... Uh, 
your war. Yes, that's good. And oh now should I get the five? I'll get the five. And because of that she learned some new things. What did she learn? Um, now she can in her strengths or um, all status enhancements you receive will last for one additional turn. Which I think the dancer can do that, but uh, well, it's let's go. Uh, buff skills are take like I mean, when you get status buffs, it uh, you get more one more turn of that buff eventually. Yeah, that was I believe a dancer thing. Yeah. I think we're pretty good right about now. Just need to get the right equipment for everyone. You're going to be my main physical fight, I believe, and you... Oh man, I have so many more swords now to deal with. Yeah, everybody can... No? No, I only have two sword builders. Okay, I have only two sword builders, good. Yeah, three spear builders. We have three spare builders, two staff users, still one X user. Got the mage's clave here, you can get the victor's thing. Yeah, alright. And uh. So I already had the best bow here. You should get the shadow bow, that makes the most sense. And, uh, Who does the shadow ball get? Yeah. Okay, she leaves blind target. It's the one that's yeah, that's better off with Hanita. She is the one who has the hunter skills. Oh, right. The forbidden X. Did I give that to Hanita? I think I should. Yeah. Yeah, I should. Alright then. Uh, no one else was using X, I don't think, no. Okay. But we need to give you a better knife. Oh, I mean, I would like another soul knife, but I don't remember where I can buy them. Hmm. Do you remember? Because I forgot. No, I don't. Yeah. Uh, can you look it up? Sure. Other than that, you can use the Mage's Clay for magic. Uh. Maybe for the I can... Is there anything for elemental attack? No, there isn't. So, uh, you want it... Daggers? And then go for a good old soul knife. Something to increase my accuracy. Uh, Everhold. Everhold? Yes. Guess we're going to Everhold for a bit. Uh, Crystal Shield. You are the tank, so it would make sense if you got the shield. That would be um, we should go for this one for her and uh, elemental defense uh, next SP. Yeah, I think this is this is a good one. Okay. Oh, you already have everything. Hmm. Right. You need to get another spear. Uh, and as well, are you looking for the soul knife? Can you also look for the Ma Magus Glaive? The Magus Glaive. You can find that. Uh, Quarry Crest, Grand Fort. 
quarry crest. Quarry crest? Yeah, quar quarry uh. Quarry crest. Yeah. Okay. And uh, other than that, we're going to. Uh, Hmm. More MPs, whole is great for a mage. So you can do physical attacks, it's so give you something for higher physical attack. Well, okay. So, physical fighters for now are. Hey, yeah, you have actually an even split in this case. That's being a thief is great. That's what, because now I can give her more SP and then she can share more SP and shit. Now she's basically your sharing bitch. <laughs> basically. She will share everything. She can also share BP, so you know it all makes sense. Yeah, the only thing she can share is probably some dick. Because she only has the pussy. She can't share dick because she's too young. I am 18 though! <laughs> <laughs> No, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. I, don't I don't believe you. But... Somebody who, with the age of 18, would makes, have bigger boobs than you. Makes me think of a Dragon Quest character. <laughs> <laughs> There's this girl in Dragon Quest 11. And because uh, her magic got absorbed, she, she became younger. Physically, and now everyone treats her like a kid, even though she's an adult. It's like, God fucking damn. She gets so angry about it, too. It's like. <laughs> it's as if she has been fallen from grace. First, she was uh, she had a D cup, D for dragon. But now, there's nothing there. It's the A cup for AAA batteries. <laughs> <laughs> it only gives energy to Lolicons. So, uh, has there been any new fucking episodes as of late? Any new episodes? Yeah, anime related. No, it's like a dry week. Yeah, I, I hope I, that... I hope Jojo will. I hope Jojo will be there though. Next, like tomorrow. It's like I was looking for like uh, what was it called. Uh, for the slime anime, but no, I noticed that there was no new episodes for it either. New years and shit. Looking for the web shop again, forgot where it was. <laughs> do, 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 do. You can find you can buy it in the weapon shop, right? Or am I mistaken? Holy yes. Guys, I can't find this shop. Where the fuck is it? Maybe you should talk with the locals. Oh, wait. Locals? Fuck no. What? They're rude. But maybe they can tell you where it is. They called me the pee pee poo poo man. And I, I would never forgive them for that. <laughs> How dare you tell the truth? Yeah, I'll keep laughing. We'll be laughing when you hear his name. Pee pee poo poo mom. <laughs> but seriously, where's the weapon shop in this place? Was there even a weapon shop? Maybe I've been lied to. Actually, I think I should really I'm supposed to move this way. It's over here, I think. Yeah, no, those are the mines. I think. Oh no, it's here. Guys! I need some weapons! I want to kill someone, personally. Man, a mage's slave is expensive, but fuck. I need one. Yes, uh, uh, you. And uh, I think that other soul knife which was in. 
I don't normally said that, you know, killing somebody personally, you know, sounds redundant, but then I remember that there are assassins in this world. Yeah, there are assassins, you know, they're paid to kill people, then you have, I mean, technically soldiers kill people too sometimes, you know, even though they don't really do it personally, but... Uh... You know, but it's still good killing, you know, so... Yeah, it's like, yeah, but it doesn't... So basically, think... uh, and it's basically Soul Knife again, I again forgot. The Soul Knife... I believe... Fuck, I forgot the name. So did you buy, did you buy the Magus? Yep, I did. Yeah, the Magus, and then the Soul... Magus Knife? Or was it the Soul Knife? Soul Knife. Soul Knife was in Everhold. Everhold? Yeah. I don't remember that name. Is there another kind of like, how should I say, map function where you can pull out all like the list of names, like in Neptunia? No, you cannot. Because that would be really fucking useful, you know? I know, right? It's unbelievable. Cold Shore, Can't Sport, Double Court, Still Snow, North Reach, Whisperville, Your Mother. Pictures Hollow, Swar Sky, Boulderfall, Clearbrook, Orwell, Burycrest, Saints Bridge, Sunshade, Wellspring. Maybe it's a city for next for, for the next chapter four. But I would see it, I would I would have seen it too at that point. Cobblestone, I sure like what's the how do you spell it, Dennis? Can you write it down? Literal Everholds. Like, where is it? Where's this code? Give me one. Yes, this one. Where the fuck is this place? Everhold. I don't see an Everhold anywhere. Maybe because you're not holding it forever. Oh, I mean, it could be better directions. Like. Yeah, do you know a general direction of where Everhold could be? Not really. Then you're useless to me, Ennis. I don't know where this Everhold place is, but it doesn't exist in my universe. Uh... Solo, Swag Sky, Cotton Cotto, Whisperwood, The Sewers, Morlock's Mansion. Oh, Tees, Curry, Crest, Reef's Menace, Reef, Brook, Saints Bridge, Blessed Man's Den, Black Market. Have all seems to be at the south. South? Yeah. But... It's, uh, it's in town for later, it seems. God damn it! It's even further south, like behind the shadowy clouds. Past the shrine. Past the shrine. Oh, it's over there today. Well, but I believe that if it is past the shrine, like south, uh, what will that look? There are two shrines. I don't remember. Let, let me let me first look at what, what shrine it is. Shit, I can't read. It's too fucking small. Uh, that's why I had business here. Uh. The story so far. Following her master's trail, I need to make a very long journey to the Stone Guard. There I talk to Natalia, who had made friends with Santa. Following that Natalia is the oh god limit where I can't have to read annoying things. The again. shrine of it's south from the shrine of the Thunderblade. So the warrior class. Okay. Everyone. Meaning it's a higher level place. By the spirits, the snow falls deep here. Rauer. Was it Linde? It's not like what it was. Well, what what oh, God damn it! This is not like a D to fall rolliken as a kitten. And it's like I'm watching Bin Bon Bini Holland 2. <laughs> <laughs> with all the fucking accents. Just getting tortured again with the fucking way of with her slang fucking accent. Oh, but then thou art a snow le leopard, art thou with it? For D arriving in this white place, it's like a homecoming. Is it a good homecoming like Spider-Man or a bad homecoming like Silent Hill? 
Poor deal, I ain't never seen a snow leopard that big before. It doesn't bite, does it? Fear or not, young ones. Linda is a bit of me. She is a gentle creature. She will not see no harm. She is yours. Funny sort of pet is ain't she? Linda is not a pet. She is my partner in love. You mean you fuck it? Yeah, that's gross. No, I mean, uh, not like that. Oh my god. She's my companion. My friend. Friends, you say, just like us then. Hey. Her fur is so soft. And warm too. No. Tell me, children. Does a woman by the name of Sun Susanna live it here? The old lady? The old witch you mean? Hey, we know her, who doesn't? I see, and where might I find her? Yeah. See that house with the red roof over yonder? <gasps> That's a big ass home! Ah yes, I do do it! Yeah. That's the old witch's place! Thank you, the children. Of course, say hello to the witch for us. <laughs> bye bye, Linda. Enjoyed the attention, dit stel. Horror. Haha, best come with me then before they return and with more friends. Rauw, rauw, rauw. Oh no. Make for the house with the red wolf. You can tell me what to do, you're not my mom. I might as well talk to these guys, maybe maybe a quest got done some at some point. You know, side quests in Dragon Quest 11, you always do them for items, not for money or experience. Say again, you always do what? Get experience points? Dragon Quest 11, you don't do side quests for uh, experience or money, you do it for items. Huh. Oh, what is this crowd? But I have journeyed many leagues to have my fortune told by Madame Susanna. That's hashtag not my problem. I implore you, pray upon the pray open the door. Hm. Damn it, tree house! Why must you make everything ellipses? Get out of my way! Oh. Ugh. You can't beat me, I have the power of Disney behind me. Oh no. Oh no, not the power of Disney. How will we ever defeat this adversarial? Uh, you mean adversary? Uh, uh, he's a dick. <laughs> uh, well, I have one way to beat Disney. Oh. I just destroyed the American government and now I have bought Disney. There, I subverted your expectation. <laughs> that was fucking disappointing. Well, I, but I subverted your expectation. That doesn't change the fact that I was disappointing, you fucking dipshit. You're only disappointed because your fan theory wasn't true, okay? That's a <laughs> it's your funny expectation. that you mentioned that, because it's basically one of their arguments. It is. <laughs> it's fucking dumb. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's dumb. Who yeah, it's lost this it's dumb. a good argument anyway? Ah. Nee, it's just that Susanna does the talking for the both of them. Wow. Who is that man? Susanna's oh. minder looks after her and keeps the riffraff from bothering her, as you might have noticed. Mm. Name's Aliak. She took him in off the streets and when he was a wee sprout. Saved his life, he, she did, 
and he's been with her ever since. Old women are commonly in need of a bodyguard. They are when folk from far and wide come flocking to have her f their f future stalled. Fame don't sit too well on her considering how little she cares for her company. Surely she does not refuse at Effie's visitor. But oh funny one ain't it. A seer who can see the future clear as day but don't tell no what she knows. Alec turns them all away, and no amount of backing or proceeding makes one spit of difference. Every now and then a fool tries to get off with Alec, but oft us not ends with up with all the other cracked skull boys to say the Finding her was easy, but talking to her made proof it more difficult. Provoke? Okay. Can I not just, you know, fight him? I think I have to provoke Sounds him. Sounds stupid to, me, to be honest. I'm just gonna save here, and then. But why is this place so cold? Because... I actually don't know. So here's my other, you know, like, I'm pretty sure this woman, this old lady, lives here because this place is just as cold as her heart. Ha! Ha ha! Okay. Let's just try to kill this thing now. This guy. This gay. <laughs> uh. I noticed that he has the gay. It was top of building on him. <laughs> I noticed that he has homophobia. I'm top of building on him. Oh, beautiful. Te 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 He's weak too nice, well. You missed. You cannot defeat me. I am too powerful for this place. Show him with true power, Linde, my standel. You oh, cannot else? use your warrior skill? No, it's for both. I need, to, I need to use the power of magic to defeat you. you I was hoping. I was hoping that you could actually pull it off with your warrior skills, but no, you just have to use your animal buddies. You can't defeat me, I am too strong, too powerful. There's no way you can beat me anymore. I have the power of anime on my side. My anime is my power. I got the power of both gods and anime on my side. Ah! Do we still have the fucking powers called that one fog like anim animal? Did that massive spear damage? Uh, we didn't have no. to, don't have the spear damage, we had the boar though. Yeah, that's a form of piercing. Yeah, I do prefer like Aldrich's fights. For one thing I can actually see the HP of the enemy. And can actually use your skills. Yeah. All you have here is just rely on, on its powers. No, my animal friends are my strength. Well, I my can tell that, but it still gets in the way at times. Is he just gonna, gonna, when can he die? Jesus, this is already taking way too long. He's gonna die tomorrow morning. Morning? Oh. Yeah, literally has no chance of beating me, I'm too strong for him. <laughs> and then I, then I got confused. Oh shit, now, is he go now you're gonna lose. Don't worry, this is not Dragon Quest. Holy shit, did that boss battle. I got one, but that boss battle was difficult. Like the one I just beat. Yeah, like... So like... Hmm? What about Dragon Quest? This is, this is, uh, this thought of a boss battle. 
who can confuse you. I mean, like, she can, like, and she can, like, make you fall in love with her and then just basically hit other characters. And oh she can, on top of that, she can shoot the laser beam eyes at everyone, doing 50 damage per person. Then she has this tentacle thing, which she can use to bite someone and then heal HP. She gets, like, three turns. Yeah, sounds like a pain. Yeah, she's a pain in the ass, man. Honestly, I had one because of luck, because like three of the party members died. <laughs> Finally, Jesus Christ. I mean, there was no way he could win, regardless. I mean, come on now. Fuck, hey, you know, there's no way you could defeat me. Goodbye, you sop. You can take the Mary. We're going to move on with the new shit. Uh. <laughs> oh, don't say that, that's gonna hurt me. Now I start to think back of Mary's... What's it called? Hmm? Now I'm thinking back of Mary Mary's death scene. Man, I can't wait until the Pirate Voice 3 commentary. <laughs> uh, no. How does thou knowest my name? That's what you want to ask, isn't it? Oh, it's probably... Alice. Yes. Next time, cl like close your Discord mic. Sorry, it wasn't. I needed to be quick about it. I needed to be quick. He was going to tell me his phone number. <laughs> Ah, I guess. Ah. Ah, I guess we're famous now. That's nice. あとは分かったことだけ口にすればいい。そうすれば外れないからね。こうして逆に信頼できる。あなたが口にすることは絶対当たるという証拠だろ。ああ。サンタの坊やもいい育て方したね。いいだろ。<笑> Hmm. Go inside and not stand here in the cold snow? Hmm, nah, that's stupid. Let's not do it. Yeah. And then we face the station. Hmm? Who the fuck stays, in the cold, stays outside in the cold snow? If you're not going to play outside. Yeah, let's play outside. Always play outside, then. Get them kids these days. Don't go outside and play. Also, I hate no. it when I go outside and see all these kids play, man. They're fucking annoying. <laughs> all I want is, you know, take your, pi take your picture because you somehow ended up being a popular YouTuber or something. Well, no, that's the hassle. Because you play Fortnite like 24 7 on your channel. And it's why you're not playing Fortnite right now on, on Twitch. 
Because I'm because I don't want to stay a virgin, you know. But you like anime. Yeah, funny enough, people that like anime have a higher chance of not be, not staying a virgin. Mm. The Fortnite players. Hmm. Yeah, but do you want to lose your virginity to a trash can? <laughs> okay, that's a bit mean of me. I should not be that mean. Do you want to yeah. lose your virginity to a whale? <laughs> to a whale. Wait, one way of making assumptions there. Sorry, not everybody's a lolicon like you. I don't mean I don't. And I don't I don't mean like the one with, I don't mean one ones with cannons on the chest. I mean like an actual whale. <laughs> No, I think that's quite clear what you meant. Besides, right? I have clearly said multiple times that sometimes boobs are nice too. Yes. <laughs> oh, it's like it's not. It's not like like if I were to say like uh, some a euphemism for girls with big tits, I would say cows, not whales. <laughs> when it comes to whales, it's something else that's really fucking big around. You know, not the white thing that should be big around, essentially. Ah. <laughs> uh. But uh, you, you can lose your virginity if you want, I'll become a level 30 wizard. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully you cast some magic. And uh, for my as for my first spell, I will make anime real. Oh no, this man is a genius. I better stay a virgin now. Also, I will make sure Ennis will not be able to become a virgin. <laughs> but I'm already a virgin, so how am I not a... a I'm going to pay a prostitute. I'm going to... <laughs> okay, here's my plan. This wizard is fucking amazing. Here's my grand master plan, Ennis. In your sleep, I will bounce you to your bed. Are you a prostitute? Tell her that you're into BDSM and femdom. And uh, that you enjoy not being able to talk because you're getting fucked, alright? And then the prostitute will take your virginity without you being able to do anything about it. It's my grand... Uh, my grand... I don't know how, but I, I cannot say no against this plan. <laughs> okay, you know what? Never mind. We should just fucking. I will just fucking do it. <laughs> one, one day I will fucking. In fact, why don't you do it? You seem to enjoy that shit. <laughs> what shit? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You fucking masochist. <laughs> uh, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> This, oh, there's one way to turn stone back to live flesh. You need a golden needle, idiot. Oh. No, all of these need to be kissed by a beautiful princess. Patience. Never heard of this thing called patience, but you should have it. Yeah, so otherwise, it's your fault that you don't like hunt on the Khmer and Antark. Uh. <laughs> oh. If you only. Do you like... hate me so much? Uh, well, don't worry, Anis. One day I will make like a six one hour part vi videos of the hunt to hunt the Khmer and Antark. Uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, you're not going to find a video criticizing it. That video got destroyed. Because everybody is just against the, uh, against you for that shit. Uh, honest. I fucking hate. Sometimes I really hate some of these communities. All the other arcs are mad though. Only the camera and talk is great. Everything else is mad. Yeah. Yeah, that is such a stupid fucking. It's like. Everybody has their opinions, it's just that this opinion feels so fucking stupid. This, this opinion feels wrong, we must purge it. Basically. It's also the whole idea of grand, moral grandstanding and shit. And I also see sometimes, like, how am I going to enter the Fate franchise? Just watch Fate Zero, and I'm here like, eh. Ugh. 
Why would you? Why would you? Why would you do that to people? You don't recommend that show. You can at least find people. Some people disagree with that one often. Grimmer and Dark. I suppose. Actually, wanna know what? I think the loudest people are the people that are on YouTube that defend those two shows the most. Mm. If you notice that, it's like if you go to something like Reddit or I guess an my anime list mm. and look at the uh, threads there, most of the time people do disagree with each other there. But when you go to YouTube, the loudest one that makes the YouTube videos are the ones that defend this shit. Yeah. You know, you basically have got an anime gurus now. Ah, yeah. yes, our wise anime overlord reviewers are telling us this show is good, so it must be good. Basically. If you want to enter the Fate fan, just watch Fate Collide and only Fate Collide. <laughs> or Fate Collide, however you say it. That's the whole, like, I can. I, I just wonder one day make a video to piss off Fate Zero fans just to say that Fate Collide is better. <laughs> just to okay. be a dick. I might just agree with you there, though, funny enough. Okay, why well, do you disagree then? No, I do, might agree with you there for I do love Fate Collide. Maybe because it's really is because of the lightheartedness. That I just get an enjoyment out of it. But you said you disagreed with me that it's better than uh, Fate Zero. No, no, I, I will say that it, it, that Fate Collide. I mean, if I were to disagree with you, I would say that maybe another show, another Fate Show might be able to compete with it? Well, I'm not saying uh, any other Fate show is bad or good, because I don't... I, I just lost interest after Fate Zero, so, you know. Which everybody considers the best shit ever, yeah. yeah. I can see why you lose interest of it. Because, you know, when the top... You watch the top point first, and it's... Like, like you see that and it's shit, and it's like, well, what else am I going to enjoy now? Yeah. If, when it comes to Fate Kalito, I just enjoyed it because at least one, I think something actually happens every episode at least. There doesn't come a point where I'm like, oh, can we please move on? Except for maybe uh, the se se season 2.5, you know, that, could, that uh, was a bit too much filler. Oh, uh, the entire run, right? Like there were seven episodes, episodes where there was nothing happening. <laughs> yeah, that's, that, that, right? that season, yeah. Uh, I did. I didn't mind the first three episodes, but then I'm like, okay, I kind of, I kind of. Come get on, it. I want to just get into the action. We're still waiting here. And Stop leaving me hanging, hanging there. Well, at least the ending was satisfying. I can't say the same for Fate Zero though. The ending of every fight always is like, it's so unsatisfying. <laughs> yeah, I man. I think the only fight I really enjoyed, some of the fights I really enjoyed, was like. Heck, the fight against the fucking mage was pretty cool for me. The slime mage. Oh. What do you think of that one? The slime mage? Yeah, you all know where he used his metal slime to protect himself from bullets? Nah, I don't. <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> don't. Like. If you're going to ask me how every fight is like, I cannot remember it, honestly. Uh, the only thing I can really remember is like the fight with Kuritsugu and. Uh. Fuck. His uh, rifle, his main enemy. K yeah, Kirei. And <laughs> Which you know, someone, like fucking... someone can yeah. point out that there's a lot of things wrong with that fight. <laughs> uh, no fight is perfect. Uh. One of my favorite, though, honestly, that that's what makes Fate Leap even more better, is that you know, you see Kira af you see, afterwards. You see Kira in like Kirei. Fate Leap, and he's just this fucking. Buffed up chef cock that makes one of the most spiciest food ever. Because he's a sadist, you know, it's like... It's yeah, I love that. <laughs> I love that, honestly. Yeah, because you're not really expected to take it seriously, but I'm supposed to take Kirei seriously in Fate Zero, and it's like... His only character is, I want to like be a dick for no reason, lol. Basically. And it's like, I'm supposed to take that shit seriously, I mean, fuck me, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh. It's, pr it's practically no different than Kylo Ren, he's angry. He's just fucking angry. <laughs> you're right. You're right. basically you're right. It's like even the Goblin Slayer has more reason for doing the shit he does. Yeah, but the, his, the reason why he's angry is still there, you know? The Goblin's uh, 
fucking guilt is this, eh? now he wants to take revenge, you know, it makes sense. But Kyle Loren is angry at Luke, Luke is dead. Now well, Luke is, well, yeah, he's dead now. So what, he's dead now. So what is he angry for? Are you just fucking angry? Yeah, everything, but everything that made him angry is fucking dead now, it's like, there's no point. He destroyed everything. Stop destroying, you're done. Yeah, the Susanna woman, what of her. Well, I was just more impressed to encounter one of so wise and astute. And her name, it sounds familiar somehow. I must reveal my tomes when this, this journey is over. You're going to read more books? Yes. I'm actually really interested in this light novel called Fate Zero. Oh no. Oh no. Don't go any further. You only go... hurt yourself. You only hurt yourself. You can't fight against the organization. He will die. No one will miss me. I will miss you. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I still just want to know out of pure interest though, not just to be a dick, but like, out of interest. What so, like, I hear constantly that like, uh, the Chimera Antark in Hunter x Hunter is like, the most well-written arc or some shit, and I just want to ask, what about it is really, you know, amazingly written though, because I, honestly, I can't really notice it myself that much. Especially when it comes to philosophically speaking. Because I hear that a lot, it's like really philosophical. I, when, when, they, when they try to talk about philo philosophy, I just feel that's just made up, to be honest. For me, it feels made up, and most of the fucking narration just feels like telling us the obvious. I can't help but, you know. No, I, I can't well, I see any of the philosophy from when I look at it. I don't, yeah, I just, I just don't really see it. But I keep talking Me about it, and I'm like, well, what, uh. Like maybe yeah, I need to rewatch that shit, but I don't wanna because <laughs> because it's, it's so still... slow. Exactly. I sat down there. I read through this shit. There are some good points. Like I will always say that some of the good points with the narration was like, for example, the backstory of fucking Netoro. Yeah, I agree. That's how it should be used. Like hey, Giles' backstory. Well, no, guide. Yeah, guide. What's guide's name? Uh, who, who are you referring that to? fucking that fucking gang member. You know? King man. Which they kept, uh, that, that became king after the end of it all. Oh, uh, was it Gero? Could Gero, I, Gero was... I don't remember. But I, I know what you're talking about, yeah? Yeah, like, what about that guy, like... That was a pretty... He, he also get his backstory also got a good narration for it, I say. I, I will say. I would say. I th the problem though is because the narration is used so often. It kind of what the fuck happened? I was just I looked away for one second. Everyone I know, Olaf is dead. It's the bear. He went on a rampage. Jesus! I'm practically dead now. Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! <sighs> No, none, none. What happened? Thank God for auto saving, I guess. Man, oh, have you seen a tweet about someone complaining that Pokemon Let's Go, Pik Let's Go, Eevee and Pikachu don't auto save? <laughs> Dude, like, that is a godsend. <laughs> it's like I don't know what you're talking about. What did you say? That, 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 that guy doesn't know what he's talking about. It's like, this guy never played a Pokemon game before. And to be fair, most games like show autosaving, so it's like, how the fuck did you fuck that up? But it's like, it's, you know, I feel like, in the case of Pokemon uh, Let's Go, I, it, it's still, it, it would still be a godsend, because there will probably still be some of the event Pokemon, like Zapdos, for example. And you want to catch that motherfucker, because he's right in front of you. But if you miss, and you run out of Pokemon, what are you going to do now? No. Uh, that's why I always think that uh, like auto saving should never should only be an extra, not be the main thing. Because um, yeah, I just don't think it works. Like, I, uh, I, I, need, I, need to, I think hard save should always be there, essentially. Yes, that reminds me of Neptunia. Uh, VR2. It went the wrong way. Yeah, exactly. 
the sound that was a good idea to let you know to give us a fucking auto safe function without you you know hard safes. Yeah, Stupid. It's only one safe though. I don't understand why people opt to go for one save file when they're, when you can have like 99 nowadays with ease. You know, see, th does the save file only take like a few uh, megabytes? Not even yeah. megabytes, I believe some kilobytes maybe even? I think uh, most of it is like a few megabytes, honestly, it's not even that much. Yeah. So I don't get what people are talking about when they say, you know, when they say this shit. No, I don't even say anything. I, mean, I don't. I don't actually know the reason why we just don't have more safe files. As far as I'm concerned, there isn't any. Exactly. We killed the bear. Nice. Man, that fan page though. Forget. <laughs> Don't forget, the people are that died dangerous. for us. Bears are dangerous. The only way you can beat them is to talk about how much you love a little girl. Then they'll be so disgusted they don't want to fight you anymore. <laughs> have you continued watching the buffed anime show? I haven't. Oh. And one of my main reasons is because I... It's fucking... It's the fuck, how should I say? The, either my Wi-Fi is fucking up, or all of these sites are getting DDoSed. Oh. Because everything is going so fucking slow. I should say this is what just watch it on anime show up in TV and just like download it. It's always better. I wanna do that at some point, but that also beats going on my PC, which I might wanna look safe for other things, you know? Yeah, so it's, it's, not, it's kinda of difficult. It's, it's not like they'll take much the gigabyte like they're not even a gigabyte long. Oh no, that's the it's not the space thing, you know, it's the other things like you know, for example the simpler thing about rendering videos. Uh, and for yeah, that's actually mainly the one thing. It's like when it comes to rendering videos, I don't want to slow down the process more than it needs to. Hmm. But don't you have a laptop or some shit that you can use instead? Do. Oh, by the way, can you not just like download it on the computer and then just set it to your phone? My phone has too little space. <laughs> I need to buy for that one an SD car card, so it has some more space. But uh, until until then, I can't. God damn it, Dennis! You're fucking yourself up. Oh, they're not with the swords. I'm sad now. I have the sads. That's okay. Why are you doing this? Because I have the sads. That's basically the story of every main villain. Main villain, why are you doing this? Because I have the sets, oh no. Oh no. Not the sets. Anything but the sets? Oh. So then the bow of trade then pestle. And then it's like by Tempest hard enough. So like... There is this uh, fucking event in Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Mm -hmm. And it's going through the entire story... Actually, half-assed going through the story of, like... GX. Oh. The GX anime. Well, and I mean half-assed as they don't let it show a few cutscenes. And a fight. That's stupid. My god, some of these fucking computers are fr fr freaking hard. Oh, and bullshit. Ah. It's like, they always have the card they need. Or they have this fucking bullshit skill. So, Ennis. Yes. What if I told you that uh, the, the Power Rangers are what they are because of Spider-Man? <laughs> because of Spider-Man, that sounds amazing. So, in... you. Entertain me. So in the year uh, se 1975, in the 70s basically, mm -hmm. uh, Toei was allowed to work on something Spider-Man related by Marvel. Yes. And so they made a Super Sentai show out of Spider-Man, where Spider-Man is a giant robot <laughs> fights enemies. He, can also, he also calls himself the Emissary of Hell. <laughs> the Emissary of Hell? He got, his, <laughs> he got his powers from the planets from the alien planet Spider. 
And I spray the main villains are, sp are aliens this time around. Interesting. Now there's also a Spider-Man manga, which at first didn't sell well, so the writer changed, who turned into this really fucking dark manga with, uh, with uh, rape and murder and everything. <laughs> yeah. It's really fucking weird. It's like the fuck happened to the Spider-Man dude? I don't know. It's supposed to be. <laughs> it's also said it's also supposed to be a friendly neighborhood spider. Now it's the emissary of hell. The fuck happened? The emissary of hell came, and oh boy, did it came! <laughs> I came too. To watch you suffer. Why do we live just to suffer, Ennis? Answer me this question. Because the world is a cool place. Because life is a shit, the world is a fuck. Kill me, I dare you! You can't kill me! You can't kill me! It's a weak thunder as well, huh? Oh, I'm trying to think, what else did it say that? Hmm? Besides, uh, besides, uh, uh, besides Chris Redfield. Who? You can't kill me! You can't kill me! I thought there was more to that line from something else. Or maybe I'm making things uh. up. It just sounds like Spider-Man going, You can't escape me! I'll chase you to the edge of the earth! That could be it. I love that for a second. It's like, holy shit. Who made this brilliant really, piece of art? He really was out there to get him. You know, with that said, I miss... Uh, you know, did, I, I wonder if they also said that in the Venom movie. No, I don't think they did. Actually, I don't think Spider-Man just appears in the Phantom movie. Yeah, they didn't want to flee, but I fucked up and I fled. Whoopsie poopsie. And so, Jesse bravely ran away. <laughs> he used the Jojo technique. <laughs> Grim, mindless, as far as the eye can see. It. Man, the drum work was great. It is colder here too. The wind cut it to the bone. This way. A trail. A secret path only the mistress knows. It leads straight to the heart of the forest. Out there the snow never melts. It covers landmarks and makes every direction look much like the other. Oh, it's like that area on Final Fantasy VII where everything looks the goddamn same. It wasn't as bad actually, that area. Well, if you are me and you have no idea what the fuck you're doing, where you're going, and... Uh, my sense of direction is, is not that great. Could be worse, but... You didn't, you didn't get Alexandra, Alexander as well, did you? I don't think I did. No, no, you didn't get summon either. What did I not get summon? No. Alexander. I didn't. I didn't. I, yeah. Alexander is a big giant block. No. Oh, I know, a big fortress. I mean, that's what it is. No, I don't think I got him. Pretty favorite to him save this. You might bring her more joy. Alright, it is fucking cold here. I owe her that much and poor. I will prevail. Ah, uh, poor Teffel Panther. Ah, fuck, I fucking skipped one. Uh, it's beautiful, don't you think? Uh, it is indeed. I have roamed far and wide on the hunt, but never by a heat a place such as this. The snow is like a silk wedding grown. grown. But even softer and whiter, and more beautiful, a silk cone? Tell me, Tessa, could thou place in a price on this scene? <laughs> of course not, silly. As much as I'd like to take it home with me, a site like this can't be bought. 
Well, here in 2018 season two, we have pictures of uh, places like these, and they can be sold. So yeah. <laughs> there's yeah. not enough room for in anyone's bag for a treasure like this. Indeed, I dare say thou art right. So, we've got a dungeon to explore. It looks like every other fucking dungeon we've been in so far, only with snow. So I guess that's my one complaint about this game. At some point a lot of places do look kind of similar. They look good, but they look similar. Hmm. And you know, I played Neptunia games, so it's fine with me, <laughs> but... Uh... <laughs> uh. Frostwing Serpent. What is this thing, man? It looks cool. And there are all owls again. So yeah, that's what well, did your friend say again again about all owls being stupid? Owls aren't really anything special about them really. We always think that they're wise things, but they're actually all the most stupidest things. They also <laughs> it's like they actually don't know shit and will run into anything. But uh, what uh, what is that makes them dumb though? Yeah, that's something I don't know myself either. I should look into that one at some point. I, I think I just broke someone, Ennis. I just did it. I broke someone. That's normal. We are playing a game where breaking is a thing. But I cannot even break you, Ennis. Because you are my Nakama. And I could never break you. Sounds gay to me, honestly. I know, right? I have to kill you right now. Just to, just to make myself more, more manly, to be honest. To make yourself a good Jedi. Yes, to make myself a good Darth Vader. I have to be really angry. Kill the gay. Kill the gay. Abolish the gay. With the white supremacy dragon and Zebra Lord Sandus. And Zebra Lord Sandus. <laughs> oh, that's what he is, come on. Let's be honest here. He is a Zebra Lord. Yeah, he is. You can't see from me. I use the power of darkness to darkness. You couldn't even darkness me even if you could. What? Uh. What? Well, what are those sounds for? What have you done? I'm uh, just changing my s sitting position. You mean your lazy position? Position, position. Yes, basically. Ah. Uh, hmm. I don't exactly know what to do against these guys, though. Just gonna defend here. Oh, they are, they are attacking me, Anders. I can't believe it. In an RPG, no. As if you're playing an RPG with monsters. Nah. You know what I still don't understand, Ennis? What? I go online on Call of Duty, then people just kill me. I don't understand why. Why do they <laughs> kill me? <laughs> you really wonder that. Yeah, of course I do. And I mean, why you do? It's just stupid to just be killed randomly, right? I mean, that's annoying. And I see you have a lot to learn. Pure young day. It's not my fault I like darkness a lot. <laughs> Maybe you should play the game with your eyes open. What? I should not play my video game with my eyes closed. But anime has taught me that if I close my eyes, I would be able to see better with my ears. <laughs> yeah, not fucking uh, that. Uh, what was it called? Deadpool. I mean, Daredevil? Deadpool. No, Deadpool can Not see. Dead. Are you stupid? Maybe. The well, answer should be yes, I am. <laughs> Ooh, Cyrus leveled up. He can now also perceive the game. 
<laughs> uh, the gay. Probably one of my favorite jokes. Guys, help me, I'm infected with the gay. Oh no! What shall we ever do? Any parts in the gay. It's a good idea. Or we could drop buildings on the homophobes. I assume they're dead now. You're a Jedi Master, why did you assume they were dead? Uh, that's a good question, and I'm not gonna give you an answer to that good question. Because I too am affected by the gay. Why is everyone affected by the gay? I just don't understand. Because it's gay. <gasps> now it all makes sense. Man, the beast keeps eluding me, I wonder why. Why would you elude me, oh beast of beast to me? Come to the dark side, Come young Anakin. Come to the dark side, young Anakin. They got cookies and snacks here. Oh fuck. Be grumpy. Be grumpy. You always when you're grumpy. I do you think I have my son? I'm not, sorry, I'm not a disappointment. <laughs> Somehow, Honestly, I thought the second the episode two was for hmm? episodes of Star Wars, from Star Wars. Episode two. Yeah. And it, it ended up being seven and eight. Who the fuck? Can't wait for two to be another shit. To be the worst shit show out of all of them. Episode nine. Ugh. Episode nine. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah, with episode two, I I think episode seven is better than two, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, because like two. Seven had some moments where I was like, I, I could joke at and laugh a bit. But it's not, not as much as, as two though, two was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> Eric, yeah, that's dictatorship, lol! <laughs> uh, nah. Just that nervous laugh and like, oh you! <laughs> oh you! <laughs> you just murdered a bunch of Jedi's, oh no, oopsie poopsie. I did think that the fun thing about episode 2 all the building they were getting. True. Because right, they right. did get some really good ones and a lot more progression with this Dark Sidious character and everything. There are there's some it's good just, things about the movie, it's just that... Um, it's just that Anakin was such an annoying teenager. And it would have been fine if it like... It would be done a bit better, especially with this bit of romance with Batman's like... Uh, oh man, yeah, <laughs> I hate the sand, it's rough. Of course, it gets everywhere. No, and the, the entire uh, uh, romance with Padme was probably the for most forced thing ever. I don't know. I, I, I did kind of look at her face. At the, when she was looking at Andy King in episode one. Hmm. I don't know how they fucking forced it their way in, like... Yeah. Trying to make it work and shit. And how it all was foreshadowed at the fucking beginning of the entire series in episode one. Honestly, it would have been fine if it just wasn't so fucking damn cliche and boring. Yeah. God. Never forget that fucking face from, from Bad Me at the beginning, at the end of episode one. Oh yeah, I'm going to suck the dick, alright? He's just nine. Yeah? He's fucking nine! Ah, he's too old for me now. <laughs> and then suddenly, the you know, Bad Me has the same face with young Anakin goes like. Become suddenly a good looking teenager, like what? Like Yoda just comes down and says, You bitch, you need Jesus! Jesus, you need! Yeah. <laughs> uh. Uh, that's also a line in the Finn Bimble video on Twitter, it's like, You guys need, G you need Jesus! <laughs> who was the one who said it again? Like, the, was the guy who said it against the Asian guy? It's like, you need Jesus. Don't remember. And that was a line in that movie. It was like, you need Jesus. Uh, 
That was my favorite moment in the movie that was in the plane. Was the plane. Don't worry, we're all just gonna die! <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's such a normal thing. I know, right? You know that blonde haired character though, like the fat, the fat woman thing? Yeah. Uh, she was funny, but she has absolutely nothing to do with the movie. Yes, <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> but goddammit, is she fucking hilarious? <laughs> I know, but... <laughs> she just fucking appears out of nowhere. You know, we all gotta die at some point, and because we're gonna die, might as well just divert and all of our sexual deeds. <laughs> I know you've been looking at my boobs for such a long time, come here! <laughs> <laughs> it's like, just like... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I know it's a joke, but she thinks she's such a fucking beautiful thing. She's the most obvious, hideous thing you will ever see in your life. I know, right? <laughs> but the beauty of it all is that there's actually likes likes the banger, which is the fucking plumber, <laughs> plumber guy who's horny as fuck about everything. <laughs> and she doesn't notice him. That was a crazy fucking move, I love it. That movie is fucking crazy, I will say that. But holy shit, is it heavy on the accents. Yes. I did have a Black Lives Matter joke in it though. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. I think the one thing that makes it funny though is the like the friends just replying with yeah okay. Well, I was like this this guy so the, did something a little bit weird but sure. <laughs> so, I know. But why is the white man always evil? And I don't understand. I don't know, but the guy was pretty funny. I know. Well, at least white people didn't shoot someone's dad in the ass. That would be a disgrace. <laughs> Remember, Ennis? That someone shot someone's, in the, someone's dad in the ass. <clears throat> Good times. I fucking like love the part that that is like, how after all the shit this man has caused to you, you're still gonna be like the wig man and say, yeah, go for it. Do it. Propose to her. Just do it. The man, you, you know, you all, you walked into your wife's room, wife's room, with your underwear. <laughs> you fucking shot him in the ass. You gave him a fucking heart attack. You don't even say hi to him, you know. To be fair, the heart attack was entirely his fault. True. And then here you are, just saying, yeah, go for it. I'm your wingman now. Your <laughs> wingman. Hey, you saved, uh, you saved us from that guy. He really liked Vox. Well, now he's going to the jail. He has a lot of Vox. Vox Tamer, though. Ah! Se seriously! Oh. <laughs> and they just, just for the rest of the fucking. Like, for that scene, they're just talking about rock jokes. Or break jokes. <laughs> Fuck, I love that. But what I also love is, like, the Chinese guy is like saying, Hey, hey, there's. You know, you can't go with the bus to Aruba. <laughs> And then, like, you know, he came up with the plane ticket thing, and he said, No, I'm not gonna... No, with the clock shit, with the jewels and shit, I'm not gonna fall for that trick. And then he comes with the with the bus tickets to Aruba. Oh, really? Oh, I need to look at those. I want to go there. <laughs> and then, you know, the police catches him, and the the well, card... You know, one of the guys even asked him, Hey, how about that fucking... Can we still... Can I still... I, get it listen, I'm not Asian, about? I'm Latino! Oh, alright, that's not even the guy. <laughs> no, he must be a guy. He looks like a. Look at his face. Looks like an Asian, right? Yeah, but he said he was Latino. Seriously? <laughs> My name is not Ping Ping. My name is Ling Ling. <laughs> Ling Ling. <laughs> Probably the greatest, craziest bit of them all. <laughs> Seriously? You need Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> when how? <laughs> oh, that was great. Uh, it's too bad the English can't can't like enjoy that movie. The Anglo people. Yeah.
No, we also we always have subs. But do they have subs? That's my question. I guess we can only wait for them. All right then, we're going to level slash this guy. Oh, look at the damage. For me, it's damage. Where did he? Where did he get that suit and everything though? They, they mean who? Lin Lin. Lin Lin. Uh, Where did he get the? <laughs> well, he's Asian, right? And we know that yeah. Asians and Japanese are the same. Like Asians and anime are the same thing, right? Right. So basically, what happened is that uh, he uses the power of anime, where you know how someone can just like magically uh, like teleport clothes so that they can wear them as in uh, as in like uh, disguise. That's how, that's, yes. how did, that's how he did it. That's how he did. <laughs> he just spilled some shades. And then exactly. suddenly the pro came out. <laughs> exactly, yeah. It's genius. Damn it, I'm blind now. I'm blind to the truth. That is darkness. I would be blinded too if I saw them then. No, I'm not blind. You're blind. Especially you, Nappa. Come on, the thing should be dead. Just kill him. You're not killing him hard enough. Uh, there you go. <laughs> You're right back. Okay. So Hani's finally reached the level 40. Uh, Alright, so... Uh, I think we can just head to the boss battle now. Yep. Alright. But first, more more darkness. You surprised your foe. Oh, that's nice. They'll never see it coming. You see that my mind is too fast for ice. You're done in. By the time it hits you, you're less surprised. Ooh, ah. <laughs> can I even defend and get a bird turn? Can I, can I just get a turn? Yeah, I can. Holy shit. Oh. We'll never see it coming. You see that my mind is too fast for eyes. You're done in. By the time it hits you, you'll have surprise. Mm -hmm. ah. Now it's time to burn them all. Burn them all, I say. Kills an unbeliever. Warrior skill, full strike. There you go. He's, he's doing the whole thing. Of course, you know, I just realized that N is left and we're now going to fight the boss battle. Yep. That's a... Uh, typical uh, thing to happen in our streams. And as well just leave and if there's a tough boss battle going on. So it's just... it's become destiny, basically, you know? Uh... I need to use um, some inspiring plums. Alright, saved. Now we can, uh, can fight against something. The herb of grace. This is all I needed. Oh, you're back. I guess this boss battle is going to be easy then. <laughs> uh, golden roll with this channel. <laughs> a dragon. This place is a dragon's lair. I have heard the legends and master tales, but too, but to see one in the flesh? Holy shit, Ennis, it's a dragon! I scarce imagine this. Oh dragon. shit, it's a fucking dragon! It's a dragon, dragon. I'm win against that. I don't know, it's impossible. You don't even have the Dragoon jump ability to win against airborne enemies. Ah, yes, did I ever tell D about the time I went dragon hunting in the Clifflands? Four times now, and the tale gets longer with each telling. It's like going to school. <laughs> Is that so? Hmm. I suppose each time I remember a more of it, the thrilling details, eh? 
Mensen, het is veel te snel dik en dan voor al de twijf beest het huis daar aan het. Tel voor lieve spinat. En dit uit Willy Willy did it. Wat in de stoppen is. Waar do I smell it so far? It's not I smell. Oh, I thought blasting. Thou bears the oof. Don't be in full. I will call the FBI. <laughs> uh, um, if thou insisted, but listen, my girl. And despite it, many kinds of beasts, some so wondrous and astounding, thou cast canst scars and betten them. When thou art older, thou too will have tales that no one will believe it, but thou must still keep them. Some will haunt by thy dreams, some will make it thee snorten with laughter, whenever thou recalls them, but let them be tell thee this honey. Wat is het beste? If you see a dragon, fucking run! Let me go! Oh, dragon, let me pet it! <laughs> oh, god damn it! Thou canst tell it to me, and I will believe every word. Thou canst tell it to me. Thou shalt hear and distill, Master, over and again until thou beckest me to stop, just as thou didst to me. The dragon skills are. Oh, you motherfucker! I will kill you for that, you old bastards! There's something I can steal from him, but I have no idea what. Holy shit, I did no damage. Do I still have to make shift, shift knife? That would be stupid. You might just have it. Yeah, I might. Unfortunately, it, oh, this is not Final time Fantasy. For hmm? Stop, time for a reset. Oh no. He's weak to swords. Well, he's weak to ice. He's not you know, he's, he's in dragon, so maybe he's also weak to wind. I mean, if I'm going by Final Fantasy logic, sure. He's weak to axes. What else could he be weak to? Wind? No, dragons. I could have uh, just analyzed him. Why the fuck <laughs> did I not do that? Uh. Holy shit! We are fighting a Final Fantasy boss! And he speaks the bow and arrow, so oh, he's fucked now. Oh, no. Now you lost the cat in one of your most powerful fighters, actually. He speaks the light. Yeah. But I don't have a lead. But, well, not. Shit! Just the fucking the main player of this fucking battle is gone. I know, right? Does she does she not come back? Get her back. Fuck. No, at least it's not your healer that was sent away. I can't even revive her. Yes, you are Hold on a minute, did I only have one XP holder? Oh fuck. I'm coming, I'm, I'm scaring myself. Oh no, honey does come back soon, okay. Just need to break this guy. I need to use the powerful light stone or some shit. A light soul stone. I broke him. I broke the seal of darkness. And now I shall murder him. For I am the power, the, the real power of darkness. Yes. It is time to destroy and destruct. I will now collect his lunch money. I did it! I stole a dragon's lunch body! 
Now I don't think even uh, Hanit's master will will uh, believe uh, believe her. <laughs> yeah, I just stole a dragon's lunch money. You said I had ridiculous stories. I guess Andrew's gone now. We are fighting in boss battles, that's to be expected. God damn it, I fucking I got back and then I forget to fucking unmute the mic. By the way, Anders, <laughs> we stole Dragon's lunch money, can you believe it? I can, because I was there when you did it. <laughs> but the mic was new. Uh, so was the point. <laughs> uh. hmm. Thinking about it. Should I just defend? Nah. With this much power, we can just cross strike him for massive damage. <laughs> uh, so one of my favorite hand types. Oh! Oh, dickhead! Come on, that's that's but that bow is, the bow sucks, you know the bow. Our bows are weak. Just make that your weakness. Come on, come on, do it. I know you want to. <laughs> just fucking roll the axe at him already. I'm not gonna get him otherwise. You're not gonna damage him otherwise. I don't really have a lot of sword users though. Yeah, you do. Yeah, I do that's not. That's no nice. Nah, I might as well use the more stones, I guess. Use the power of light to light him up. <laughs> Sorry, but I wanted to lighten up the mood. Ah. Your jokes suck. Oh. And as I've been told, my joke sucks. What now? Well, they always did. Oh, why are you also mean? Sorry, uh, you know, it's just, it's difficult to hide the facts, you know? Oh, why are you people so mean to me? I've always been nice to you, haven't I? Or have you? I don't know, have I not? What have I ever done to you? Everything. Oh. It all started in 1991. I want to see the point of buying people. Hmm. Hmm. Buying people? Yeah. For the different kinds of effect they might, might give you. What are the uses? Maybe they break the enemy, maybe they give a status debuff and stuff. Uh oh. God damn, Primrose is dead. God damn, Hanit is also dead! Jesus Christ! Well, you are fighting against the dragon, so... Yeah, but it's like holy shit, man! Oh boy, I need Primrose back for healing. But I don't know what else to do. This is why you have an apothecary. No, it doesn't matter because he will die too. Yeah. Oh, oh no, man. funny enough, you can have one of the most HP out of all of them. But then again, maybe the defense doesn't matter. Hopefully, I get better luck. Because everyone was at full HP too. It's like, fuck me. Alright. Oh, I'm not gonna steal from him. We've got better things to do, I think. Uh. Yeah, I got, a I got the wrong knife. Oh no. Ah, uh, boy. Oh, what then? Yeah, this sucks. This sucks. Well, I guess he's gonna force you to reset by any chance. Not if I kill him first. <laughs> Good boy. But can you? Well, I, we'll see. Uh, if, I, if I can't kill him, I'll die. Yeah, that's, it's pretty simple. So I'll just die. I guess I'll die. Not a big deal. Okay. I guess I'll die now. Well, I guess I'll just die. It's not too bad. 
<laughs> Everyone dies once in a while. Everyone dies once in a while. Everyone dies once in a Holy shit, he has made himself weaker now. You fool. Now you are weak to my power of destruction and power. You're blind now too. You were a fool, mighty dragon. Fooled by your arrogance of power and destruction. That must be power of destruction. <laughs> I don't think he knows what he's talking about. I know what I'm talking about. I am the anime guru. I, the anime guru, always know what I'm talking about. Are also the same anime guru who just started a, a cult? No, that's the end. Uh, yes, yes. But cults are great if you, if you just like try them out. If you just try them out. <laughs> yeah, if you try them out, they're great. <laughs> don't understand why people don't like them. Just don't get it. People are just being babies about it. Fucking white fragility. My white male fragility. That's what it is. Do 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 And now, with the power of light, I will enlighten your day up. Oh. Man, I love making jokes. Unfortunately, yeah, not, a lot of people, not a lot of people like my jokes, unfortunately. Don't know why. Can't help it when it's bad. Mm. But they are high quality. Yeah, it's just every oh. person with bad, jo no, with bad kinda, jokes. You know, he could, he could easily kill me, you know? Ready? Oh no, honey is gone. No, I'm fucked now. I'm fucked. Honey is gone. Nothing can save me. I would say if you had better luck if you went for something. What should, how should I say? If you went for. Uh, fuck. Honestly. For provoking him and then increasing your defense, but with the amount of damage he does, you're gonna die in, a se in two turns with honey. I'm gonna die anyway, you know? It's like. Uh... But I really need to destroy his card, or else I'm really fucked. But I'm already fucked. I'm already Tracer. <laughs> I wanna be Tracer. That's the bad kid, I'm already Tracer. <laughs> oh my god, I love that. It's like these. You, you enter the toilet. And then suddenly you. you know, the, And then suddenly you see all of these guys in the teak pose. One guy says, I'm already, I want to be Tracer, that all of the other guys sing, is sitting sick. I'm already Tracer. I'm Tick, that great. What is going on? I already told you, I am already Tracer. TikTok is great. TikTok? <laughs> yeah, TikTok. Oh no, I don't really know anything about TikTok actually though. Oh, you don't? No. TikTok is just basically... YouTube 2.0? Poor man's uh, the new vines, but then longer. So YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Well, what it is mainly is you know you have your people in one of the most uh, common. Oh cases, no. Common videos are where the, you know you have the song. Mm. Where uh, you know, and then people will go and you know act in sync with the song. You know, do some movements, maybe sing along or lip sync along. And then you have some of these people that. Well then, you know, then you have uh, a duet with that. Well, one person, you know, records his syncing, and then the other person can then record his syncing and it's, you know, edit it next to it, right? Mm -hmm. But most people make fun of the person who does it seriously. Why does she have two turns? Oh fuck, Hanit is dead. Why Hanit? I really needed Hanit. Oh no, Hanit is not dead. Oh, but it's dragon like... its wings white, oh no. Like, one of my favorite is like, you know the I'm already Tracer song, right? 
Some people like when look at the video and then they put another video next to oh, it. Oh, and it's it's going to be a be a uh, all or nothing. But then they, <laughs> oh shit! Oh. You're fucked now. One attack, you're dead. Oh, you did it. And your you got a good but so make sure the perfect time. Donate a BP to someone, we're gonna do it now. I think you need more than just donating the PP. Maybe some more health for Hunted. I'll do it later. With the power of Skoda, I can use Blizzardle. So, uh, you, were, you were talking about TikTok, right? Yeah, there's a... Uh, and then somebody goes next to it, and then they pay attention to the, the girl who's singing it seriously, right? Mm -hmm. And they see that the controller is turned off and she's just, you know, pressing buttons. I think actually she's playing the game, but then this person just picks up, this, you know, first picks up the control, his controller says, you know, points at the light, and he picks up just this fucking, a fucking sign saying, turn your fucking controller on! Or other, or there's this other guy who just, you know, who rears, who holds his headset like a controller. There's two Xbox control like a headset. The fuck is wrong with these people? <laughs> Next to the girl who's doing it seriously, and it ends up, TikTok ends up being something more like a, an an ironic TikTok or ironic TikToks, where you know somebody does it serious, and another person just makes fun of the person who do, does it serious. Oh, oh well, maybe this will be the end of the one. Oh no, why Hanit? Why always Hanit? Why is it always fucking Hanit with you? Because we need to take the tank out first so we can get the party wipe out. Mm, but what if I'm the party wipe out? Well, it sucks if you then. No, I am the party wipe out. I think you don't understand what I mean. What the heck? Ah, I think someone's expectations were subverted. <laughs> uh, the entire fucking joke with this with episode 8. The joke is that it in itself is subverted now. So, uh, Ennis. No, no, what he told yes. you. I thought I would have told you the thing about Spider Man. Don't know what all of that bit, bit pills I could feed you. Hmm. You wanna know what I also liked about Bomb Mini Hollow? What? <laughs> that one part of the battle where. <laughs> no, where the, where the final scene where the, guy, where the white guy loses, right? Mm -hmm. And then one of the statues where, who, who had a dick just falls on his back. <laughs> there were more rocks. There were a lot of stones for him, really. <laughs> you can say he got stoned. Yes. Oh! So, uh, uh, yes. I don't know what to do. I can heal that guy. But then he killed Primrose. It's like, what the fuck? I didn't see that one coming. My, my expectations were subverted. God damn it, it's doing his job. Oh. What do I do now, oh mighty dragon? My expectations keep, keep being subverted. Someone is even fucking dead. Fuck. Where the fuck is I need when I need her? When I had eat her. Mm -hmm. I had eat you right now. <laughs> no, don't use dragon fire. Oh, you fuck nugget. I will now have five poppies because of you! <laughs> Why? But the poppies had done nothing! Why would you hate them? Because they killed my mother! There, I subverted your expectations. Yeah, I think I subverted your expectations, didn't I? 
Yeah, but I, I just fucking did it. I know, and I'm amazing. I fucking subvert your expectations. You're such an amazing writer. <laughs> I know it. Nobody could ever, would ever be able to compete with you. I hate this dragon. I don't care if he's Luffy, if he's like Luffy's dad. Luffy's dad is a bitch. Fuck Luffy. I'm sorry, Luffy, but your dad's kind of a dick. I didn't want to do that. Didn't expect it to be that great. No wonder he wants to keep a lead out of the game. Oh god, no one has PP anymore. Oh, can I give PP to some people? Bottle of the Whittling Dust. No, 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 no. The stores HP and SP. Massive Blue Source PP. It is just from Crate and it is from Crate. Is it all we get? Alright then. Gonna have to deal with that. Oh boy. Are you still there, Ennis? Yeah, I'm still there. Okay. So, uh, what, do you have anything interesting to say about last, like this week? No. I finally got my vacation from work. Oh, how long does it work for two weeks? Isn't oh. that nice? When is it and how long does it last? Well, it started with today. Oh, really? Yeah, so I don't have to work for them. So next week you're going to come over, right? Let me see how actually I could. I can have my school case while I could. Louise. Got the dragon down! Oh no! What about the dragon? Uh, just, I just want to ask you if you want to come over and kill the dragon for me. <laughs> oh no! It's just, it is preparing an ultimate attack! But I've got Hanit! But I need to have SP anymore! Oh fuck! Maybe you should donate SP, but fuck, she's worse! She is still. Fr she still gets her turn, and you also gave her some other abilities, so. Just trying to get him to get him as quickly. Fucking attack four times with Teres in the hopes of doing as much. Yeah, I guess that's all I can do. Let's see. Yeah, you don't you don't have anybody else to trust on, so yeah, attack with Teres four times. And use your strongest Blizzard against him. Not the Blizzard. Ah, uh, second surfing is not a thing, I guess. Oh well. Uh, 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 uh. Come on! Oh. All right. right. Now let's. So just, we just still kill have... him. You're just kill him. You gotta do it. You gotta break him. Just kill him. Come on. We can do it. We can kill him. It doesn't seem like you even equipped, you know, honey with any bows either. No, I did. I did. It's a shadow bow. Bow. Then why the fuck does this guy? Is it the? Is it? Is it, is it the skills? Does he have a massive fucking defense while the guard points are off? I don't know actually. Maybe you did equip the knife then. Well, we can check after well, this Whatever fight. it is, you broke him. Whatever it is, I broke him and now I'm gonna murder him. Merciless, mercilessly, mercilessly. Oh! Man, I, that really subverted my expectation. Tress was the one who killed him. You just killed the dragon and it's, I can't believe it. You did it. You actually killed the dragon. Is it done? Have I slain the dragon? Well, Luffy's dad is dead now. I can't believe it. That must be the herb of grace. Now to leave this forest and... Rauer. It's alright, Linda. The monsters are gathering here. The dragon had ruled this forest had been slain. 
They will not attack on us, not for a while yet. Come, Linden. Come on, Linde. Susanna will then will win wa awaiting word from us. Yeah. Now that I I have the herb, I can finally face Red Eye. And save Master from the deadful dreadful curse. Rauer. Honestly, we're basically on a like on an adventure to save our dad, essentially. Please. Yeah. Found the herb, did you? They waited for me. Susanna only asked D to show on us the way. I have my own mind. A man can ta can tarry where he likes, can't he? Of course he can. Hmm. Anyway, I'm done tarrying. Suppose I'll go on ahead. Ha, I must appreciate your concern. Uh, well, I just irk. Oh, I think someone is a bit embarrassed. Someone's a bit shy. Oh my god! What a strange man. This is going to be the start of a beautiful relationship. Anyway, the travel band. Holy shit, we killed the dragon! I can't believe it. <laughs> How charming. What art thou sniggering about, Primrose? That Aliak fellow, he surely fancies you. What? Thou speakers nonsense. The t the he treated me as Susanna bade him, as a guest of her home. Oh, trust me, I know men. Oh yeah, I know men, always. <laughs> the way, the way he acted towards you. It wasn't anything like the way he acted towards the rest of us. But, but, oh, bless, look at you, blush. Tell me, honey, what do you like in a man? Uh, I, I don't, that is, um... Someone strong, stronger than me. Hmm. Well, good luck with that. You might be searching for a long time. <laughs> Honestly, you might as yeah. well be an animal yourself. And uh, what we didn't know is that this like, like this broke out the biggest cat fight in history. Shit. <laughs> women are women are scary. Women are scary. Go home. There she is. Found the herb of grace, did you, child? Here, yeah, give it to me. It needs to brew for a spell before it will work right. Thank you, thank you, D. So, how did it feel to slay your first dragon? First dragon? And more dragons. Down the roost, it was there. There. If you couldn't slay that dragon, you wouldn't have a Cinder's hope in the blizzard of surviving an encounter with Red Eye. Oh boy, does Red Eye also have bullshit boss attacks? Thou art not a woman to coat it her words in sugar, art thou? Never seen much point in it, my dear. Now, why don't you tell me about that dragon while we wait for the herb to brew? As thou wishest. While Red Eye is capable of is summoning a Red Eye's Darkness Metal Dragon and just overload your fields with all the Dragon Monsters. Oh god, that's why she says that's why we had to slay a dragon. <laughs> We're now the Dragon Slayer. We'll first summon a Tuna Monster, and then summon another Dragon Monster that is that's level you know, to get it equals eight. So they then can secret summon Stardust Dragon to make sure you can't fuck him over in one go. And then he like the he summons secret summons Stardust Quasar Dragon. To make sure that you, don't, that you don't touch anything. Anything. I was never much for talking. It was Master who taught me how to read through stories. Ah, uh, that lad was a tongue tied fool in his youth as well. Um, this, um, that. He could scarily, scarcely put two words together. Surely it was not that bad. Trust me, dear. What grain of eloquence! He now possesses what's thrown into him by yours truly. 
I think twice before you tell him your tale, he might be jealous to hear you speak so beautifully. It is true that he does not enjoy being shown up in anything. Here go, this shit will not do the trick. To be fair, when we kill Red, Red Eye, we already, we already like, uh, embarrassed him in a way. We already humiliated, humiliated him. It's like, ah, we could kill him, you couldn't, you fucking idiot. Ah! I want to kill Red Eye. You be sure to call it down in one gulp the moment Red Eye's foul curse strikes you. Thanks, thank you, D. Too soon for that. You can take me once sometimes back to his old self again. Very well. Herb of Grace, X10. Okay, het west of town. Uh, no travel banter, so we're going to enter chapter 3 of uh, Hadith here. Are you Hanid? Oh, oh um, are my expectations going to be subverted? Right, right, right. I am the yeah. one of the knights who don't. Uh... At your service, I bear a word from Lady Elisa it's about the, the fiend Red Eye. Has she found? Has she had found it? Yes, near the desert city of Marsalim, she awaits you there. Then that is where I will go away. Thank, thank, thank you, you, if you will excuse me, my lady. <gasps> what the hell is this shit? Hmm? What the hell is going on? What? I'm suddenly hearing that my, my sister may just, you know, get fired from a job. Like, what? Your sister? Yeah, my little sister. I thought, I didn't even know she had a job. She got a job at some point and now suddenly she might just get fired for it. What did she do? I don't know. That's the problem, it's she didn't do anything, oh! It's like, the thing is, is that, you know, she tries to work, of course, mm -hmm. but sometimes gets sick, and then all the times, you know, she doesn't get, she doesn't get a lot of work uh, either, you know? Mm. I should have said, she doesn't get scheduled a lot either, but suddenly, she gets a fucking phone call from her work saying, hey, you, you know, we want to talk about your fucking con contract like what hey man want to talk about your contract how dare you be sick fucker because oh. you didn't schedule me a lot either well it's fucking your fault right, huh? well that's your problem schedule a lot more often but how does that even work i can't do it i don't control that shit then why don't you become a manager and control me. that shit i just <laughs> i can't suddenly become a manager that's stupid you're stupid no. It's not like the manager, so scheduling things. Who's doing the schedules then? It's uh... Dio! Oh. I believe it's most of the time just somebody who's specifically hired for the scheduling. You hire someone for scheduling? Yeah. Sounds like an easy fucking job. It's like I just come into a building, say, this will happen at this point, and then I'm going home. I'm done. <laughs> I go to these sleep. These people will come and work these times. Any other questions? Yeah, why does this person work at that that <coughs> So, one less mouth to ask questions. I'm going home now, I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I didn't know it was legal to buy a gun and kill people. It, it can actually be kind of a tiring job, but from what I've seen. Okay, I will hold you up, it's my friend will no longer go in safety, my dear. Because at some point you do need a person, and then there's almost nobody because you fired most of them. Most of them, you know, fit the job. Watch. Talking about my workplace. Ah. Too many people are leaving work, and the only reason why is because of the boss's wife. She's a bitch. Who's a bitch? Uh, the boss's wife. Oh. Thanks to her, we ended up with a lot less, you know. Colleagues. Really? Yeah. It's, it's she, her behavior. She uh, she acts too much like a stuck-up bitch and tries to you know act as if she knows everything better. Oh, she's one of those people. Yeah. Oh no. Or no. And then the worst fucking thing about them all is like it. It's for the smallest things. It's like one of my colleagues was just you know working with her because. Pretty busy, 
-hmm. But she noticed that, oh, look, the boss, the, the wife from the boss did something wrong. Let me correct her. Let me tell her, you know, hey, you did something wrong there. And then she says, hmm, maybe we should get fucked and go somewhere else. <sighs> Ah, uh, she's one of those people. Fuck me. Yeah, and then the, the person decided to, you know what, well, you know, with that fucking attitude, I'm not gonna do what you say, bastard. And then they wonder why there's so little people thinking. Hmm. Yeah, that's like the thing in school. It's like, oh man, you have to work together with that other kid because you're going to work with people you don't like at some point. Yeah, but they're fucking, they're doing, they're not working as a problem though. They're not help, they're not working with you at all. It's not just as so, so simple as, oh, I can't get along with that guy. It's like, I want, I, this is the right way of doing it. And the other person's like, oh, fuck you, I'm not gonna do this. Yeah, that person we're talking about is the dick that won't help you with your school project. Exactly. You'll make the entire volcano thing. But at the end of it all, you know, he's gonna get all the praise for it. Either that or when it all goes wrong, you get all the blame for it. It's like, but I did everything and did it. he didn't do shit. Exactly. It's like, you know, you know, you know that uh, that guy that kicks Kraus for no reason? Kraus for no reason? Kraus, yeah. yeah. You know that that guy, Ennis? Remember, remember him? I remember. Yeah, like, I, like, I had to work with him, go around the, the classrooms and, like, to give tea and sh such to the teachers and shit. Mm -hmm. He never shuts the fuck up. <laughs> oh, I know. And then I get the blame for it because he doesn't shut up. It's like, what do you expect me to do? If I tell him to shut up, he will punch me, you idiot. <laughs> Do you think this is? Capitalism. This is not capitalism. Look at the f it's like some people you cannot work with because some people are just mentally unstable, or right? Like you try to work with them and they're just unreasonable, but you still get the blame for it. Like you're expected to work with that shit. I'm sorry, it doesn't help work like that. Some people just can't work together. Uh, I don't get it. Go, uh, go, go home. I don't get it. Go home, you're fired. Why? Because you were being too loud. I didn't do shit though. You did. You were too loud. But I know it was the other person that kept talking. You're too loud. Oh. One day, one day I will take over the world. <laughs> and I will destroy the universe. <laughs> By nuking space. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you try to support my expectations? <laughs> you know, it's, a, it's also virtue expectations, right? It's like the story space, we expect that, so yeah, that's a great idea to do. <laughs> uh. Someone's expectations needs to be subverted, Dennis. Why though? What do you try to gain from this? What oh. is your damage? Oh, I have a lot of damage. <laughs> uh, let's see, we're going to do Cyrus's or Primrose's story first. They're both at the same level, though. I don't know what to bring along. Oh. Yeah, might as well take both and kick Hanita out of the party. Now, but who like separate like the Osterion or Ulbrich? There are the chapters also at the same level. Hmm. Are the chapters also at the same level? Yep. They only have two chapter trees left. One for. Uh... Yeah, but are they both at the same level? Yeah, they're both level like, forty. Difficulty. Yeah, they're both level forty. Hmm. Either we're gonna be really stingy and look at who needs the most, who needs the most XP, and then put him in the bench, but or we're gonna just toss a coin. Uh, hmm. The both physical fight is. Well, that's also a good point. But maybe I should, I should bring Ulbrich because Tess is already a knight. Then make Ulbrich a hunter or some shit. Yeah. Nothing will change essentially. But basically, have the same setup. The same setup. Oh, by the way, we can also check if we now have an, if we see a knife. Yes, she had the makeshift knife. The wrong fucking knife. Did Hanit have the wrong bow as well? No, it has, she had the shadow bow. Do I remember that clearly? Uh, check. I don't need to check. I fucking know it, Dennis. <laughs> yeah. There, you see, shadow bow. Get fucked. There we go. Nice. There you go, nice. Get fucked, Dennis. Oh wait, you won't because you always stay a virgin, you fucker. Jesus Christ. Oh, fucking ass. Who was the hunter before him? No one else. Okay. Then we can just. Uh, 
Oh, 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 oh. Is this the first time he has become a hunter? I guess so. Well then, it's time to learn hunter skills. Eagle Eye, Mercy Strike. Well, I'll take aim. Take aim is good. Take aim is pretty good actually because we can't use the axe and shit. Yeah. And I can learn second surfing now, which uh, is good. Summon strength, endure, inspiration. But it's for, yeah, it's for standard attacks. I don't really need it that much now that I think about it. I think second surfing will help us a lot more. Yeah, there you go. Uh, other than that, now we just check his equipment. And I'll give him the Forbidden Blade, the Victor's. Uh, uh, yeah, pick the spear. Spear is, is great. Forbidden axe. My accuracy will be shit, but uh, I can only have two things to boost my accuracy. It's fine. I have two of those. At least I got my answer. What? What happened? I got my sister's contract. What happened? You don't know shit. Oh, great. <laughs> to put it in simple. So, they're just gonna, you know, because the contract is just going to end this month, so you know they're gonna make it's gonna talk about it simple, but so it's not, uh, so it's more like so you can only get fired because uh, for the contract, like yeah, so they're gonna just talk about either she's gonna work and say you were really terrible, so get fucked. It's one or the other. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, I have a weird, I have an odd request for you. What was this odd request of yours? You see, I submitted my book, uh, my manuscript. Mm -hmm. And now I got an email back, and it's like, after two days, that can either be two things, in my opinion. It's like, either yes, they just... Again? Like, they, I just got an email back. Yes. Which can either mean two things. Either what? it's uh, just a confirmation that they are going to look at it. Or it was so fucking terrible that after one day they already decided no. <laughs> and so, what is your request? No, well, I'm just gonna send the email to you, and you can tell, you can read it for me because I don't dare to open it. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sure. Whatever. Uh, fuck it, sure. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Everything went wrong that night. <laughs> the Fire Nation attack. The Fire Nation attack. <laughs> oh. You know, like it says thank you as well. It's like thank you for your submission. I'm like, you don't thank me. You don't have to suffer because you have to read my shit. <laughs> yeah, you were awfully negative about it. Listen, mate, I have no self confidence. Like, I can enjoy it myself, but I have no self confidence in anything I do. Yeah. Uh, my lack of confidence is my downfall, I suppose. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to do Primrose. I think we should do Primrose first. Go to the Flatlands. To the Blonde Lands we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's why the uh, is here. What a beautiful name. Yeah, the Blonde, the blonde Lands. The story so far. The town of Still Snow. Primrose got her first taste of revenge. There, she stuck down the left wing, <laughs> the left wing of the crow. No oh, more social justice bullshit here. Sword served her well. Now, to remain. The man with the mark on his right hand and the foulest bird of the hall, the mark on his neck. Go home, noble card, she said. They will find the food you seek. And this is gone, apparently. How long has it been? Why I left, I thought I could nev would never return to this place. When I left, huh? Yeah. The crowd said I would find the truth here. But what truth was he speaking of? Two more men bearing the mark of the foul bird. My search continues here. Look at that young lady. Is that not Lady Primrose? I am being recognized here. You're, be you're seeing things, friend. How's Alzart is nothing but a memory now? But right, of course. No need to drag up old ghosts. There's plenty enough going on in the present. Just look. So is Primrose going to keep her identity a secret? Or what's happening over there? Don't 
Darling, please open your eyes. No, say it's not so. Man, if only the apothecary were here. Uh, you know, I'm standing right beside you. <sighs> Quite a shame that just his, as his business was so hard to take off. Rumor has it it voice he says his displeasure with his lordship a bit too loudly, if you catch my meaning. <gasps> oh, the Gustav over here! That's why I keep my mouth shut. Let's, lest I end up dead on the street like that poor saw. The murder in noble court of all Well, to be fair. When I was young, father and the city watch saw that hardly a crime was committed here. What has become of this place since I left? Move out of the way, you slack jolt fools. Man, what a bunch of assholes. We are here by express order of his lordship to inspect the scene. Now clear out lest we toss you in the ga gaul for impending the investigation. The lord's own guardsmen are investigating the crime. Where is the city watch? Hmm. Ellipses, 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 ellipses. Ah, three houses added again. <laughs> I know that man. He was one of father's trusted friends. Revello Forth Revello Foresight, Lieutenant no. Commander of the City Watch. At least he used How to be. There you talk negative about the three houses localization. Oh so I was spared the wet of the crows at least. Why is that now? So it doesn't really matter. Oh no, he's not dead. This is evil. Oh man, we're subverting my expectations. So they from still snow. So I fear the tidings are ill. Master Rufus is uh, he has been deaded. So the left wing has been clipped. It was the Asselhard girl that did the deed, you say. So she still lives after all. Heh, <laughs> guess we'll just have to do something about that. Mark my words, the Asselhard li line ends here. Ah, you just put up a death flag for yourself, but dude. Fucked it up. Basically. You just fucked it up. Lady Primrose. Is it truly you, Lady Primrose? I know that voice. From a lifetime ago. Yeah. Do my eyes see too? You have grown lovelier than I ever could have dreamed, Lady Primrose. Simeon? 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 Hm. Where have you been all these years? Not here, that's for certain. You know, I always wanted to run as fast as far as I could from this stuffy old town. Hmm. So I let out on a journey across the realm. And yet, no matter how far I traveled, I could not escape from the pain of losing you. Well, I'm not dead. But you're probably going to die though, because everything has to be emotional. And painful. These days I make a living as a playwright of sorts. I pen dramas and tragedies for the stage. Tragedies, not strategies, the fuck. You always did have a way with words. I swore I would never return to this place, then one day I felt an odd yearning. And no sooner do I arrive than I am reunited with you. Fate is a mysterious thing, is, is it not? Yeah. We shouldn't never have zero of it, because then it sucks. Ah, get it. Play 2 Is it never 0 of 8 because then it's play 2 that sucks. Yeah, okay, okay. But enough about it. You really love that show, don't you? I Talk about it. Yeah, I know. It's, it's like I'm, uh, I'm, the, I'm like one of those people that like, hate Fortnite. I just can't stop talking about it. <laughs> but I won't complain about people talking about it a lot. There's not a thing I can say without sullying his memories of me forever. My apologies. That was too forward of me. You needed to say a thing. Besides, I can imagine all too well without hearing a word. 
life has not been kind to you, and though you have grown all the more beautiful through the hardships, you no doubt suffered. It still pains me that you had to suffer them. Simeon's hmm. gentle words stirred something in Primrose, a feeling she had not felt in many years. For the first time in what seemed like forever, she felt somewhere deep in her heart measure of peace. I don't want to murder him, break his fucking neck, could, like chop his head off and throw it down at funeral. <laughs> he is too kind to me, he always was. Oi, what are you two doing loitering around? Oh, I guess we can't even just stand somewhere. Fucking authoritarians. Looks like a, sp a spot of trouble is, uh, just as soon as I arrive uh, it. Come, my lady, let's find somewhere we can chat in private. Ah! Seeing you again, it brings back so many memories. And there's voice acting here. Ah, oh, yeah, I remember. I remember everything. I could never understand why my father was so strict with me. Nani. You know, that doesn't really sound all that appropriate. And we're talking about uh, someone of a certain age, but whatever. Kind of, kind of reads like a love story, and it's kind of, kind of like, uh, kind of a little bit weird in this uh, context, you know. If you, if you catch my I mean, I've watched enough anime. I've already seen enough weird shit, so I don't really give a fuck. But uh, just saying. <laughs> so somebody will, will make an FBI joke. Like this. And someone will make an FBI joke. I mean, we don't have the FBI. We have the City Watch now, or not the City Watch. We have the church. Ah. Oh, you found me. What are you going to do now? Hmm. I'm going to make you go through tutorials. Oh, no. And then we're going to make hot fuck. What? What? <laughs> Oh man, my expectations were subverted once more! <laughs> <laughs> it's just a joke, I like to subvert expectations, so you're one of those guys. And the when the moon waxes full and bright in dark hef uh, heaven starts glitter rolls away from earthly sorrow. But that sleep holds you in her soft embrace. Then shall my eyes close lip close lips open in prayer, for it's only in dreams that we may meet again. What are you typing? I'm just looking into Jaden's voice actor. Because it sounds really fucking familiar. It's English voice actor. Nah. Lady Primrose, I intend to remain in town for some time yet. Nephew Charles. Oh well, I need to kill some uh, some guy. What? Murder? You? Yes, murder. 
Must murder someone. I mean, to be fair, we've always seen weird shit in this game as well. I mean, remember that guy was really fond of his daughter? Like, oh, really overly family friendly with his daughter. You remember that guy? I remember that guy. <laughs> right. So who's this Simeon guy? Well, was he someone really special to you? Hmm. Tressa, have you ever felt a special kinship to someone? A special kinship, you mean, like, aside from my family? I guess I never really thought about it. Trading's been my life since before I can remember. I kind of feel a connection with my customers when we make a good deal, is that the same thing? Let me tell you something, Tressa. And something about the person resonates deep within you, it's the most wonderful feeling. Your heart is freed, your mind is opened, and you realize there's more to the world than you ever knew. But I wouldn't expect you to understand that at all, you're still a little girl. I am 18 for fuck's sake! Hey, what are you calling little? I will fuck you up, mate! God damn it! Every fucking day! Hmm. May I be so bold as to pry? Huh? That man is. Hmm? Was it you, Ennis? What? The knocking? Maybe. Oh. For what I've noticed, though, is that no, the voice actor of Jade and Yuki isn't the same voice actor from Sonic, but they sound goddamn similar. Oh. It's like I listen to it and I can just not help but hear Sonic from it. Now I can never play Yu Gi Oh! ever again. <laughs> no, you can't watch the English of GX ever. Well, I'll say it will be one to anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> Why do you say? Why the this circle jacks you based on how you both look at each other? Had you not chosen to live your life the way you do it, one way? You can stop right there. How I live my life is my affair, not yours. Y yes, I quite, I do apologize. I had best be careful around him, he's sharper than he looks. He would join the tree some. <laughs> no, he wouldn't, he's too dense. Farewell, Geoffrey, I will return. What's this? Are my eyes to be believed? My lady, are you Jeffries? It has been too long, Master Foresight. Too long indeed. We all knew you would grow to be a great beauty, but even still. I feel as though I am standing before a vision from the heavens. It brings me great joy to know you are well, my lady Primrose. Well, I mean, well, I mean, I'm not a pet of revenge to murder people in the most brutal way imaginable. But other than that, I'm fine. Hmm. As it does to me to see you hail and hearty, Master Foresight. It just swooped my back and blurred my eyes. But just seeing you before me, I thank the gods for blessing me with long life. You flattered me over much, my good sir. I was just paying Jeffries a visit, as I do from time to time. You should do the same, Lady Primrose. Let your father bask in your beauty as well. No. I cannot face father, not yet. For that, there's something I must do. I'm sorry to hear it, my lady. But where have you kept yourself all these years? There are many here who would have been more than happy to take you in. I have been on a journey of sorts, if you must know the truth. Forgive me, I had no idea you had suffered through such dark days. Yeah, but now I have friends and dead bodies. Lovely. And dead bodies. <laughs> Lovely, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> it is well to endure and return to us, Lady Primrose. I endured only because I must learn the truth behind Father's death. And it's kind of entertaining to see a co corpse wobble around when it's falling on the floor. It's kind of funny. Makes me laugh. Fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> That's the foresight. Is there still nothing you can tell me? Hmm. Hi. 
There was a time when I too spared, spared no effort in trying to unravel secrets behind Lord Jeffrey's murder. But in the end I was left wishing I never had. My lady, I urge you to tweet lightly, tread lightly. This business will be the death of you if you do not watch your back. I am ready for whatever may come. I have other people to watch my back. My friends are my power. Very well. Can I watch quotes everywhere? <laughs> it's, a, it's very quotable. Sometimes for the wrong reasons, though. I know it is. You do quote them a lot. <laughs> it's so easy to quote, though. Two. Two? <laughs> I'm taking. I am fucking better to you, although it's an experience. <laughs> I haven't really, I haven't heard anything of the Young Turks lately. What have they been doing? Have they, are they destroyed? Are they, are, they, are they gone now? They gave up living. Oh, I'm free now. And I, you know, in my YouTube suggestions, you know what I see right now in the corner of my eye? What do you see? Ten hours of soft lolly breathing. Breathing. <laughs> Maybe there's something wrong with you, I don't know. I don't know. Sounds pretty calming, to be honest. <laughs> but my, but I never, and so beautiful a woman grown. Pinch me, my dear, I must be dreaming. I thought the same myself. Now that what to say we share a cup of tea. Now she didn't expect that that, that woman right there is actually the neck grow. Subverting expectations. <laughs> and so from the dark day onward. The balance of power here in Noble Court shifted and shifted dramatically. Under Lord Jeffrey's stewardship, House Isohart was the most prominent of all the great families. Working closely with the City Watch, he took it upon himself to uphold the peace and keep the people happy. Crime of any sort has, was nigh unheard of. Oh, what happy th days those were. But you know, some people have to fuck everything up because fuck it, they can't be happy with that. <laughs> so those with a, a want to do all ill deeds. Well, this might have found it a bit stifling. But it matters little. Those times of peace and security are all about the dream now. Oh. In the chaos and disorder that followed the fall of House Isohart and a group of, a group of men seized power. They call themselves the Obsidians. Doesn't sound evil at all. They began their operation peddling illicit tinctures back when your father still lived. Working in the shadows just out of sight of Jeffrey's watchful eye, they made one shady deal after the next filling their half coverts with and making powerful friends. Swayed by the influence of their coin, countless once lawful men cast their lot with these villains and the ones that didn't. Captain Albus commanded the city watch in those days. Maybe you remember him? Yeah, Albus Care Packament is right. Like uh, Albus uh, Dumbledore, right? Yeah, and I remember that guy. He's a great wizard. No, not that. Oh, fucking God. He was Lord Jeffrey's right hand and the most just and honorable man I've been privileged to know. Unfortunately, his code of honor put him at odds with the obsidians, so they took action. Murdered, like my father. Absent his leadership, the city was collapsed and the obsidians obsessed power with the greatest of ease. I spent years trying to follow the trail of corruption to find who it led to, where the blood money flowed. And yet I found that it, I was up against an opponent too evil. I have faced innumerable threats to my own life. That guy was too evil. His name was Dio! Oh. Did you know that Dio was like something human? Hmm? Did you know that Dio was actually something human? Something human? Yeah, the guy that invented gravity. Or at least discovered. No, what is the right word for that one? Do you believe in gravity? Something with, this, with gravity. Do you believe in the gravitational pull of Earth, Jotaro? Basically. Honor and justice are long dead here, never to return. 
Well, I'm not honored, but I'm certainly justice, and I have returned. I am an old man now, and grow, and I grow weary of this battle. I am but a minor lendo landowner, with no influence of which to speak. All I can do is bring flowers to Jeffrey's grave. There is nothing more I can do for him or for you, and so I beg of you, Lady Primrose, leave this place. Trust me, my lady. Were your, fa were your father here, he would say the same. But I have to murder someone! I would back to different before I said, were my father here. This is, this is what he would say. Fate shall be your shield. That's stupid. Yeah, but uh, I'll do it. Mayhap you are right. Mayhap I have only twisted my memories of Jeffrey to ease my regret of my own cowardice. Forgive me, my lady. I do you a dishonor. I know where the obsidians make their headquarters in the town. I will take you there. Sure, I need to, I need to somehow kill someone. We'll, I will wait for you here, my lady. Pray tell me whenever you are ready to depart. Okay. But uh, we're not going to do that because uh, we don't have that much time left. We can yeah. do a travel bent here. Honor. Tell me, Olbrek, what does honor mean to you? A simple question, but one with some no, no easy answer. For me, it is using my plate to protect others. There is not else I can offer. Sometimes I think you're too humble for your own good. No matter how love our aspirations in the end, we can only do what we are capable of, better than to make ourselves the best that we can be than dream in vain of stainlessness. Okay. Well said, that's what I'm trying to do, improve myself so I can do more, especially since I met you, you're, you're a true inspiration, you know. And guts, I hope I'm not pushing again. Uh -huh. Hmm. What can I buy from you anyway? And it's like 5 cents here. Hey, oh, got the danger up on this club. When we get started, and we ain't gonna stop. I am not afraid, so that's not my way. Thank you, thank you. Nice. What have you done? What happened? Someone's dying. He's looking at something epic in one piece, I guess. Alright. Well, uh, we're gonna stream again tomorrow anyway, so it doesn't really matter. You know, we're, we're finishing this game as quickly as possible. Actually, we're not streaming it tomorrow, but tomorrow. What day are we streaming? <laughs> okay, tomorrow is a commentary. So, yeah. what, uh, what times are you available Saturday and Sunday? Well, as far as I know, the entire day. On both days? Yes. Hmm. No. I'm free for work. I don't need to work in the evening anymore. Because I'm free for work. Neat. In that case, we're just gonna stream on Saturday, I think. Yeah, hopefully nothing will come in with stream at the out of nowhere, so... Yeah. So Saturday we're going to continue Octopath Traveler. I will see you guys then.